Hey guys, sorry it's been a little bit of a long time, but um, oh my god, it's been, it's been crazy. <laughs> it's been some, um, well, I'll just say being evicted from my apartment, which wasn't my fault so much. <laughs> well, it was, but now I have something in my eye, of course, but um, huh. <laughs> I am here in Waltham, Massachusetts, and I wanted to show you all this really neat armory over here. Kind of reminds me of my old apartment. <laughs> my old apartment at the manor, the ma which was a great place, but um, it's good to be out of there. It was a little moldy and crusty, but um, I'll go more into my eviction. I want to show you this gorgeous building here. This is some sort of armory. And I was reading that they want to turn it into affordable housing. But I doubt, I really doubt that's going to happen. But, um, it's really cool. It's not cool given what society is going through now with the guns, but... This is where all guns should be kept somewhere, like, safe right here you can see the charles river this is going to be along my walk today um why is the charles river famous i'm not sure but i think it's one of the biggest rivers in this area now i have a more interesting question does it have eels in it and yes <laughs> i read the charles river has eels in it. I know. <laughs> Why is that interesting? Hey guys, so yeah, I am, I'm obviously trying to stay out of the sun. That's just my thing. <laughs> but um, yeah, as for the apartment thing, yeah, I guess I, would, I won't be caught on camera talking about that. <laughs> but um, it's all for the best and I know wherever you go, there you are, but, uh, you can see, I don't know if you can see the, well, the Charles River's back there, and, but it is, it's an idyllically gorgeous day, and it's, I guess, the beginning of summer, isn't it? Beginning of summer weekend here. My goodness, I didn't know it got so sunny in Boston, or Waltham. But, um, it's beautiful, just beautiful. Maybe you're wondering why does she keep filming in a cemetery? But, um, I have to say this is close to where I'm living and it is, it's actually extremely peaceful. There are days where I just need to just be in my own head and not be around humans. And I really think the pandemic, the pandemic's made it almost more acceptable for that introversion thing. But um, I have to say, this is a very old cemetery and I was seeing markers in here, like 17 stuff, people born in the 1700s, which makes this part of the world, even more than North Carolina, it's just really old. You know, it seems like a lot of these markers are 1800s. There's also, notice, plenty of people hanging out in the cemetery, also taking walks. And there's geese. I saw a bunny and a saw turtle. So, isn't that cool? <laughs> I have to do a video of this area. It's, it's, I mean, despite the cemetery aspect, it's pretty. It's really pretty, huh? You see, there's some little, little cute. Oh God, they're so cute. <laughs> I love baby, any, baby, baby, anything. Not so much humans, but aren't they cute? Oh my God. This is a strange scene. It almost looks like snow, but I guess that's the dirt. <laughs> well, I don't know. 
But um, it's really, it's, this is the biggest cemetery I've ever been in. It seems to just go and go and go and go. So I have to say something I really love to do is explore new places. I just find it, it's just so much fun. It's like someplace you've never been and then you go and like just check it out. And there's no um, memories or emotional associations with the place. So it's just, it's just real exciting. I don't know, I love it. <laughs> it's more exciting to me than buying a house at this point in my life. I just, just find it really cool. I don't know, I've always been that way. I have to say also, it's one of the most creative, nice plots I've seen. Just different, very different. This one's really pretty. It's kind of etched, etched in stone. This is the cutest thing I've seen in a little while. These chipmunks. Like, I always see them in Asheville, and I was sad. I thought, I won't see any more, but look, I hit the jackpot. <laughs> Actually, that little chipmunk just went into a hole in the ground. There were like three hanging out. I was like, oh my god, I've never seen three chipmunks. 